Hey, welcome back. This is Dave Briner from Synergist Technologies. Uh, today I'm going to talk about uh, creating creating custom view scales in an inventor drawing. Uh, recently I've been asked, I don't know, numerous times about how to put in a scale that more aligns to a, a customer's standard. So this is a pretty quick tip. It's easy to do. So I thought I'd uh, uh, go over it real quick. Um, if you remember in my last um, my last blog, I showed how to insert uh, a scale into a drawing. So today, um, I'm just going to go through and how to create custom scales. And if we go to the Manage tab on our drawing and uh, select Styles Editor, and uh, like anything else, if you want this available from drawing to drawing. Uh, you would do all this work in your template not in your current drawing so make sure you do it in your drawing template and then save it um, to your library so make sure everything's uh, up to date when you open up a new drawing so I'm going to open it up and you're going to go to your your highlighted uh, standard that you want this to take place in and come over to the general tab and down in down in the middle of the panel here in the preset values uh, you're going to select the line weight uh, pull down here and you're gonna see under there is a scale and this is the general scales that come out of the box so all I want to do is I'm going to add and I'll just say I'll say one quarter and I'll say okay and um, now you can add new and I'll say one half and you can click apply and it'll stay and that way you can highlight over and I can even add let's say um, six inches equals one foot and this is a valid scale so I can I can apply that and uh, okay so I'm just gonna say uh, save and close I'll start a, a new sheet and uh, I'm gonna place a view so you'll see right here come brings my normal placement and I can go in and here's my new scales now these will be pretty small for the object that I've selected here but you'll see right away that they um, they will come in and uh, just the way so here's the six inches uh, equals a foot so the same as one half so it's the same scale but you can choose um, which way you want to bring that scale in so and it works pretty nice and uh, if I go in and I edit the view you'll see that uh, that's that's the one that appears and I can go to that pull down and choose a different one if I like just uh, just like usual so that's it um, anything that can um, achieve a numerical dimension you'll get a scale out so give it a try see if you like it hopefully uh, it'll help you uh, set up your standards a little bit differently so again till later this is Dave Briner uh, thank you and have yourself a great day